Yeah. showing you what's in the June 2014 glossy box. This month's glossy box looks like a standard glossy box but actually everything inside this box this month was very useful and I'm really excited to show you what I've got. So this was the first thing I noticed and it's from Rituals. It's the Qi Gong Organic White Lotus and Yi Yi Ren 24 hour antiperspirant spray. I do like the Rituals stuff, I think it smells really really good and it's a lot of fun to use and I love the way that it's all Chinesey because I'm Chinese. This is really cute to take along with you in your handbag or travelling so you don't have to carry one of those big giant deodorant cans. Because this is a really small can it's just great for like weekends away or you know if you're just going for the gym and stuff you don't want to carry a big can with you. This has a very clean and fresh scent. Definitely something that will neutralise bad odours. Let me tell you, on the tube it is not fun at the moment. It's summer, it's hot, everybody is sweating loads. People are holding their arms up high to hold the poles and you breathe and you're just like oh my god, I am gonna vomit. <laughs> the next item that really excited me was this which is the Volume Million Lashes by L'Oreal Paris. I've never actually tried this mascara, but I'm very excited to. The brush is just a rubbery, spiky brush. It's pretty straight, but it's very dense and quite a large brush. So I'm very excited to try this out and see how it goes with my lashes. Then this little box stood out to me. It's from Tease. Trendy Cosmetics and it's the Beautiful Eyes Flat Stiff Brush that comes inside. Precision application, ideal for eyeshadow and natural hair. So this is what the brush actually looks like. It's super cute. It's got like a rose gold barrel with very densely packed white bristles on the end. This is comparable to one of the MAC eyeshadow brushes. I can't quite remember the number. I want to say 217 but I think that's the fluffier brush, this is definitely the dense brush that you use to pack on eyeshadow and the design of the brush mirrors the packaging. So this is definitely a brush that is going to stand out in your collection. Then I picked up this because I wasn't sure what it was, it's the So Susan Concealer Quad. No mineral oils, no perfalate, I'm not sure how to pronounce that. No animal byproducts, fragrance free, with marula oil, hypoallergenic and non-comedogenic and it's got the cruelty free with little bunnies on it. So this is what the product looks like and if I open it up you've just got the four concealers in there. You've got one that's really white, you've got pale skin, medium skin and dark skin. So this is good for mixing, they're really creamy, I think they need warming up a little. I'm not sure if you can see that but it looks like it will give quite a bit of coverage and then you can build it up to your desired effect. A compact of four concealer shades that covers dark circles, blemishes and minor imperfections. The texture blends seamlessly into the skin to create a flawless complexion formulated with virgin marula oil. And the final product is from Nail Girls. It looks just like a clear polish. This is 10ml so this could well be a full size as well. And it says 3-in-1 base, top coat and nail strengthener. Brush is quite a good size brush. It's, a, it's not a thick brush, but it's a standard size brush. I think this product is useful for most. I know some people don't like to do their nails. I love doing my nails. So this is definitely a good product to keep handy because it is your 3-in-1 base, top coat and nail strengthener. That's definitely always a good thing. That was this month's glossy box. I hope you enjoyed my little mini first impressions kind of video. For me, all of the products in this box are going to be really useful and I'm really excited to see what's in the next box. Thank you so much for watching and I hope to see you again really soon. Bye! It's really hard to read on clear nail polish, but I'm actually really hot right now. Debultil perfalate. Don't know how to pronounce that. 
just to compare, I actually have some simple sensitive eye makeup remover pads. So they come basically in the same size bag and they are pretty much the same size wipe.